<laughs> Genshin's 4.1 update just came out, and while that means an Archon quest, a new character, and a bunch of other things, the first thing I'm interested in is the interactive map. So let's check out what people have been up to. <laughs> now look, the new region starts around here. Alright? And of course, we have to check the Hydroculus first, because K said on my previous video that he had something new in store for us in 4.1. So let's get to it. This is the first Hydroculus right here. <laughs> here we go again! <laughs> Welcome to the 4.1 area! I'm your Hydroculus guide in this version, Tepe! There's your first Hydroculus! Really easy to get, yeah? Tepe! Oh my god, Tepe from Watatsumi! He aged from young to old in the span of a few days because of a delusion and he just died trying to protect his friends. I'm seeing a trend here, Kay. So first, that's Clothar, okay? The guy who lost his child who turned into a hillichurl. Second, you have Tepe, the guy who died protecting his friends. What's next? Half Dan? Huh? He only picks characters who've been through the worst tragedies and reincarnates them to do this. <laughs> K is a necromancer. There's no other way to do it. Welcome to 4.1. <laughs> what the f is that? Alright, so listen, we're at the bridge. We can go through multiple routes here, but I'm just gonna dive right into here, the water. Let's check it out. <laughs> what was I? What was I expecting? And yeah, he has the mask, he has two arms, telling you there's a Hydroculus here, and it's just there, while underwater. <laughs> Glad to see Kay still doing good. Next we have this right here, with, with more of K, with more of Tepe, I should say. Me waiting for Clothar to show me the Hydroculus. <laughs> No Clothar this time though, but you've got the next best thing, that's for sure. You know, there's a lot of underwater Hydroculi this time, so I'm wondering what's... <laughs> it's so long! That is such a long arm! God damn, Tepe's built! What the hell is this? I'm K and I need Clothar to hold me in the water. <laughs> what the fuck is that? That is so weird! Oh my god! That was so... Where are you, Clothar? <laughs> yeah, where are you in this one? What the f***? How can we live without Clothar's guidance? <laughs> yeah. What's this? Be honest, you're probably here to see Clothar's. We are all in the same boat. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly why I'm here. That's why you're watching this video. True! And I think there should be another Clothar right around. <laughs> I love the f close ups. They're the best, dude. It's like, yo. <laughs> okay. All right. What's next? Oh, true. Okay. There's a guy called DJ. He only shows up a couple times in the map, but his sh is so cursed. Look at this. <laughs> it's so stupid. It's like he took the most cursed emojis and was like, there it is, man. <laughs> I'll just do K's work for him, but even more cursed. And then there's this one right here. <laughs> and what's Chi Chi doing here? It's so cursed. Oh my god, man. What's this? <laughs> Everyone's adding their own twist to it, and I love it. I love it. It's really cool to see the community come together like this. <laughs> Like, Tepe comes together with Hydrocus, dude, every time he has two arms. And most specifically when his arm is in that stretch, it's just so funny. I don't know why. Oh my god, his arm is huge here. Holy sh**, Tepe. That delusion is giving you gains. Where can I get one? How do you guys get up there? <laughs> okay, so check this one out, okay? Listen, for this, you have to climb high up by doing some puzzle, all right? And there's a lot of people that got frustrated from this. The first one, of course, is reject modernity, glide from big mountain, which is honestly really smart, yeah. So you're telling me I spent 30 plus minutes climbing the mountain thrice only to glide to the wrong bridge? <laughs> So 
So look, you know the drill, all right? It's not just Hydroculus, it's also chests. Here are some of the funniest ones I've found so far. This one right here, fire and some other Fatui guys, right? Woman, he's talking about her. It's so, like, where do you even find this? Thinking, oh yeah, she just, she looks just like that. Oh yeah, there's this one. Shao's finally mine. Please help me. <laughs> They're so stupid. It's so funny. Speaking of cages, I may have f***ed around and found out. <laughs> A lot of cages in this update, huh? So look, look, listen, you know I love long arms, right? <laughs> well, I have a doozy for you. Look at this. <laughs> he doesn't have one or two. He has four. He's telling you what to do with the puzzle, like here, 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 and here. <laughs> You'll have the chest. But here's the thing. Then you go down and you see, do whatever my brother with long hands says. <laughs> Oh, I love this. Oh, and we can't have a map without yoi me ass, of course. <laughs> like this comment for Banner, look. How I feel looking at yoi me ass for 20 hours. <laughs> you guys are so stupid. <laughs> oh, and an honorable mention right here real quick. There's this really cute thing going on where, not you, this person right here, L, Unalives the enemies and then the chest appears so they draw the enemies where they were before they were defeated for reference There's another one right here. It's really really cute. I love it. I, I hope they add more. It's really wholesome Like look at this little crab. Look at that <laughs> And of course we have to end it on Tepe saying goodbye right here, where he's fading away. This is the final Hydroculus. I have done my duty. May we meet again somewhere in the future, Traveler. On top of blasting, you know, giving you instructions. Literally me when it's actually on top and I tried finding it at the bottom. <laughs> Thank you for your service, Tepe. I hope we meet again someday. True. And everyone else. You guys did an amazing job. But yeah, that was the 4.1 update. There's a lot of stuff still being added, especially for the chests. It's still very early. I mean, it just came out a couple days ago. So I'll keep you updated. I'm definitely going to make more videos on the interactive map. Don't worry. But for now, that's it for me. Oh, and make sure to join the Discord. We have a pumpkin carving competition starting for Halloween. Winner gets $25 in Prima Gems or Jage or whatever you want in Hoyaverse games. And second and third place each get $10. So make sure to join and give it your best shot. I'll see you next time. Mwah. Thanks for watching.